A brand new season of anime means we try a bunch of new series, keep the ones you guys want, drop the ones you don't. But don't worry, that just means more time for community poll series. Let's begin today's reaction. I think this is a rom-com, right? Something about a girl without glasses. Whoa, this camera work is crazy. Looks like it's curved, but you know, it's not. It's so far like the animation quality is top tier. Camera work, insane. But like, what about the story? Is the story good? <laughs> what is this camera angle, bro? Like, I get it. The animation quality is top notch. Oh, okay. They seem to get along. But there's gotta be a twist. Like, it's not just gonna be some random, normie ass vanilla rom com, right? Holy shit. This is actually like movie tier anime. Isekai? Huh? Dude. No, that didn't actually happen. Okay, he was daydreaming about her and a truck couldn't went by. <laughs> like, I'd be down for Isekai again. This camera work is tripping me out in a good way. Why do I feel like I'm, like, I'm in like a Spider-Man movie with all these different crazy camera angles? <laughs> we're getting more dynamic angles compared to fucking like Attack on Titan when we're on the, uh, the ODM gear. Oh, he sits right there, right? The main character seat, right? <laughs> right at the back, right by the window, right? And then the main girl interest is right next to each. But... Does she like you bad? Damn, even the chalk animation is going crazy. Huh? A little quirked up, is she? It's a little bit quirky, yeah? Why? Why did you fall in love with her? There's gotta be some reason. You can't just tell me you have a glasses fetish, right? No glasses. She's kind of different. She looks a bit more angry. Uh, maybe she can't see and she's pissed off. I, I don't know. Oh, wow. Oh, oh wow. I didn't expect her to talk to us. I know it's just a good morning, but okay. You should ask her right now. Hey, that's a convenient conversation starter. Where's your glasses? Hey, a little grouchy. But like, she can't forget her glasses every day. Like this entire series is called the girl like forgot her glasses or something. Like, you're telling me she's gonna forget it every episode? And then she's like not gonna be able to see. She's gonna be in like this blind state and he has to like guide her? How do you forget glasses? Like, I don't wear glasses. But like, this is something crucial. Like, you can't see without it. So wouldn't you just immediately be like, oh, I need my glasses. The moment you wake up, put on glasses. Isn't that how that works? So like, are they gonna bond by him just helping her figure stuff out because she can't see? Kind of angry. Look, uh, it's kind of cold. I'm kind of scared. <laughs> oh, oh, that was a double replay there. <laughs> But she's kind of bold, huh? If anything, he's like the shy one and she just aloof, don't care, quirked up. Maybe a little alpha. Oh my god. The most classic, wimpy, spineless, rom-com main character. Just clueless, coward. Oh my god, she breathed on me! But hey, that's the, that's the formula, right? We gotta... I don't know why. Do we have any Giga Chat rom com main characters? I don't think. Because, like, usually these, like, rom com series are marketed towards a specific demogra demographic, right? They want. Because, like, if you look at series like Kubo won't, uh, Kubo won't leave, me, leave Me Alone, or, like, um, uh, Komi Can't Communicate, or, like. You, you know the rom com series where the main character is, like, a super shy, submissive guy that would never have a chance with any of the girls, but the girls, like, fawn over them? 
because because they're super shy and submissive. You know, like the their anime industry is incredibly brilliant in the fact that they're marketing these towards that specific demographic, which are all the weebs and otaku, right? Like, hey, make your money. That's why the main characters are always so fucking weak, man. Just because you get closer doesn't mean you can't read. <laughs> I don't think that's how that works. And this would have never happened if she didn't forget her glasses at home. You know what we should do? We should steal those glasses and break them so that she'll be dependent on us. <laughs> I don't know about that. Oh my god, you're so close to me. Come on. Start screaming. <sighs> Triple take. Yo, that look. Yeah. Do you even know her name? Does she just know him as the guy that sits beside me? Yeah. I don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> okay. It's kind of hard to be like, oh, how nice. When she's like glaring at you, she's like, thank you. Like, I know she's not actually angry, but you can't put him on. You got to put it on for her. And then you have to walk her home too because traffic's, you know, dangerous, right? Let me put them on for you, baby girl. Give me them feet. Look at the way that she... <laughs> okay. Remember? The guy that sits beside you? We just had this conversation like five minutes ago. They're not your shoes. You probably picked out someone else's shoes. Yo, whose lockers are you going through? It's probably your shoes. How did she open it? Oh, this is a bit intimate. Sharing shoes? Oh, a little naughty. Kind of cute that she's... I don't know. Wearing our big shoes. It's a little intimate, you know? It's like, oh. <laughs> what else do you want to share? <laughs> Jealous of my shoes! Oh, he's definitely going to sniff those shoes as soon as she takes it off. She can't see. <laughs> I gotta stop. I gotta stop. <laughs> Oh, he's got to put those shoes on. It's probably a little hot. You know, you ever, you ever, you know, go to a bathroom stall and then the seat's kind of still warm because someone else was there. Terrible analogy right now, but uh, it's kind of keeping it warm for her. Oh, that's disgusting, man. Ew. Surprised he didn't take a sniff of the shoes. What's wrong with me today? Tie her up for her. Tie it up. Come on. She can't do it. You got to do it. Get on one knee. Man, this is the best thing that's ever happened to him. Her forgetting her glasses. I'm telling you, man. We gotta break those glasses. We gotta steal them. We gotta make sure she can't see anything. That's the only way this dude's gonna... Not getting turned on by her fucking kneecap? I, I get it. There's a skirt there, but... I'm telling you, man. We gotta break those glasses. Mm. Oh, it's not a big deal. That's what good friends do, right? I don't know. Does he want to be friends? It's got to be more than friends. Maybe we start off as friends. This is the best day of his life. <laughs> if you think about it, like nothing really happened. We just like shared textbooks. Tied her shoe. Right? But like, <laughs> this is the best thing that's ever happened to him. It's that blind girl, Riz. Exchange numbers. Get closer. Get closer, come on. This is so far pretty wholesome. It's nice. Show me properly next time. How about don't forget your glasses next time? How are we gonna show you if you forgot your glasses? But, like, I'm just thinking. If, for every episode, is she gonna forget her glasses? Huh? Mie-san. Dude, I hope he starts like stealing them or breaking them on purpose. <laughs> and I, that would actually be so funny. <laughs> kind of fucked up. <laughs> so funny. Did she forget again? What? Is that her right there? You forgot again! Is this girl actually gonna forget every day? Oh, this is the best thing for you though. Oh, she broke him! <laughs> This is great! This is amazing! This is dangerous. You, sh you shouldn't be doing PE. Are you playing dodgeball? Uh, mm, mm. 
It's all fun and games until you get headshot because you can't see shit. That's also dangerous for us. I, I guess that is a curse. Yeah, we didn't wish for it. Hmm. Oh, she's touching him. Oh, oh. You're out. <laughs> Bro, come on. This camera work is like they don't keep any scene boring like whenever there's just like a uh, showing like kids like walk around random pedestrian like you know like not important scenes they make it that's that the the camera work makes it interesting if you know what i'm talking about he's not even trying to hide that she's sleeping she's not she's sleeping bro <laughs> no one can read that close teacher notice this is where the teacher throws like a chalk or like a the eraser right well i don't i don't know if the teacher would do that to a girl but oh you're gonna touch her you're gonna touch her yes well you probably like talk louder hmm? Okay, and why is she sleeping then? Oh. I mean, that doesn't really explain why she's not responding, and everyone can tell that she's just sleeping, but okay. How did that work? I don't know. It did. He is so reserved. Oh, there she is. She's up. But, like, he will never touch her, huh? The bed head is kind of cute. Her head's also just, like, messy, you know? Maybe looking for her glasses out of instinct. Oh, dad, I can be your daddy. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, you're a school. Yes, this is your dad. Say something. Come on, play, play into it. You, you, oh, you, you into that? Are you, are you, in, are you into that? <laughs> I think she's just in a delirious state. Like, even though she's awake. On him! Bro! Oh! This is the best thing that's ever happened to him, man. Like, we better make sure those glasses remain broken. Well, you didn't initiate it. She did, so I guess it's okay. But his legs are fucking shaking, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> He's a little... Well, it was like a little wrapped up... I don't know, magazine. Is it the next day or the same day? The third day in a row. Well, technically it's broken because it's got to get repaired and everything, right? She gets in your face, man. Hmm. Hello. No, it's me, your dad. Dude, that glare. <laughs> yes, you are. What if she could see, though, and she's just playing it up? Hmm? Oh, oh. Oh. So she can see if she gets super close, but... Okay. Contact lens. Ah! We gotta... We gotta steal those contact lens and get rid of them, too. <laughs> Bro, so, we gotta keep this girl blind. That's the only chance we have. <laughs> Curse her again, come on. All the new animes we're checking out, I think this is the most prettiest in terms of animation quality. God damn, the camera work is insane. Pretty simple premise, you know. It's a blind girl, gotta have her glasses, forgets it all the time. Why? Because, you know, that's what the author's... You, you gotta do it so that she's gonna get closer to him, because god damn, we know that he's not gonna make a move. But the more she stays blind, the more maybe they can bond, even though she got contact lenses. Now, I hope that he actually steals the contact lenses or something, because it's like... The whole show is about her being dependent on him because she's blind. Like, I don't know. Let's see what happens. But hey, if you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.